Hello everybody, in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to make your own satin line bonnet for your daughter and you can hand sew this or sew it with a sewing machine. So let's get started. You're going to need a half a yard of cotton, fabric and satin, soft measuring tape, elastic, marking tools such as Taylor's chalk or a water soluble pencil, scissors, thread, sewing needles and you, if you intend on hand sewing a safety pin and a pin cushion with pins and ribbon. This is also optional. Okay to get started what you're going to do is take the soft measuring tape and measure your daughter's head and whatever measurement you come up with add an inch to that and that is going to be your elastic measurement. So I got 20 inches I added an inch which is 21 and I cut my elastic at 21 inches. Okay next you're going to fold your fabric in half once and then fold it one more time and you're going to start measuring along the folded edge right here. And you're going to measure down 12 inches. So here's a diagram of it. This is the folded edge and you're going to measure down 12 inches all the way around to create this fourth of a circle. And then you're going to connect all the dots that you created or markings and then you're going to cut it out with the scissors and you should get a circle. Do the same thing with the other fabric. Now take both circles and put them together right sides together. Make sure they're very even on the ends and begin pinning them all the way around. Now take your measuring tape and measure about an inch in from the edge all the way around and you're going to connect all those markings as well with, the, with whatever marking tool you're using. Now you're going to take it over to the sewing machine or if you're hand sewing and sew along that line, leaving a three inch gap. So you can flip it over like you see me doing in the video. Now you're going to uh, take your pins and pin that opening so you can know where it's at. And begin measuring again. This time I'm measuring an inch in once again because I have half inch measuring tape. So just add a half an inch to whatever size the measuring tape is for your measurement for this one. And, and do the same thing. Okay, so now I'm going to be leaving a one inch gap this time and I'm going to start sewing within that three inch gap that I made in the very beginning. This is going to create your casing for your elastic. So here's my elastic. I'm taking a safety pin and I'm putting it into the elastic so that I can thread it through the casing that we created. Once you get to the end, take both pieces of elastic and overlap them like I'm showing you in the video. And zigzag stitch them where they're connecting on both sides of the elastic. Or hand sew it if you're hand sewing. Sew up the one inch gap along with the three inch gap along the edge of the bonnet to close up your casings. You can also sew straight down the elastic on four sides of the bonnet to keep the elastic from twisting up 
that's also optional you don't have to do that if you don't want to and then you can sew on a cute little bow if you desire to do so and you're done I hope this video was a great help to you if you have any questions please leave them in the comments and thanks for watching bye